Hey everyone, it's Ashley, and as you can tell from the title, this is my December wrap-up and my journey to be read. In the month of December, I read six books, which kind of surprised me when I went on my Goodreads and to look at, see how many books I read for this month and aim for the month of December. And I was kind of surprised, to be honest with you. I didn't think I read that many books. So, anyway, the first book I read in December was A Great and Terrible Beauty by Libba Bray. Um, it's three stars. With so much hype around this series, I was expecting it to be better than it was, and I didn't really like it too much. I was kind of actually, to be honest with you, I'm kind of disappointed. Yeah, just ignore that. My shelf just fell. Anyway, yeah, that's how I kind of felt about the book. Um, anyway, the next one is Number Christian Nice Girl by Paul Carlin and Jennifer D. Duggar. This was, um, okay. I think I give it four stars on Goodreads. The next one is this one. It freaking took me three months to finish this book. Holy mother of lord. So it was kind of a relief to finish this one. It wasn't bad, um, or anything. It's just, like, kind of, like, it went over my head. Um... So I kind of had to read it slowly. The next three go together, but it's if I can Starlighter, Warrior, and Definer, all by Brian Davis. The books one, two, and three in the Dragons of Starlight series. Um, yeah, this was freaking amazing. I think I gave the first two books 4.5 stars in grades, and I think I gave this one five stars. Yeah. Um, for January for this month, I. It's kind of actually kind of like a sequel month. Um, I do have one standalone here, and I'll tell you in a second. But um, the first book I want to read, it will want to finish because I'm currently reading it. It's Liberator by Brian Davis, the last book to Jack into Starlight series. And um, I know I've been reading this for a little while now, but I'm only on page 171, and I've been reading it like for like four or five days now, but I've just been really lazy. I'm not in the reading slump or anything. I've just been lazy. But I need to finish this. I want to finish it before I have to go back to classes, which is January 8th. The next one is... Freaking day, everything's falling. Anyway, the next one is actually the standalone, and it's Fives by Amy Kathleen Ryan, which is one of the books I got for Christmas, and it still has a sticker on it. Anyway... Um, the next one is, oh wait, first of all, kind of like a new, another resolution for this year is to try to finish some series, um, before I start new ones. Yeah. And I have two books here that are ending of a series. Well, three, if you count Liberator. But, um, so yeah, three. Um, this is one of the books that ends a series, and it's I Love Surrender by Julie Lesson. This is the last novel to the Winds of Change series. I was going to put this off, but I've been looking at it, and I'm like, I really want to read it, and yeah. But, excited to read it. Um, don't fall. The next one is Rebel Angels by Libba Ray, which is the second book to the Jim and Doyle series. I'm going to into it with very low expectations. Hopefully I'll like it. Hopefully it's better than A Great Interior Beauty, but yeah. The next two go together. Perfect and Unbelievable by Sarah Shepard. This is book three and book four in the Pretty Little Liar series. Um, I'm actually liking the series. Like, I kind of, like, went in like hearing that the writing was really juvenile and stuff, but I actually really enjoy it. And um, the next one is actually a last book in the series, and that is Finale by um, Becca Fitzpatrick. Um, this is the last book to the Hush Hush Saga, and um, I actually forgot her name for a second, so that's why I was like, uh. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to read this, and I didn't, okay, I didn't like Hush Hush. I really loved Crescendo. I thought Silence was okay, so I'm kind of going into this, like, hopefully it's a really good ending to it, but, yeah, I don't know. Um, and the last book I'm hoping to read this month is The Iron Legends by Julie Kagawa, which are just three short stories that have to do with the Iron Face series. So, yeah, um, my secret Christina gave me this for Christmas, and she really wants me to read it, so I'm going to go into 
into it and hopefully I'll like it. So those are all the books I want to read for the month of January. Um, hopefully um, you guys have a good reading month this month. Yeah. <laughs> have a nice day. Bye.